YouTube family, what's happening? It's your boy, Bull City Dasher, and we back with another video. So it's Wednesday morning. Got my, uh, I got to deliver that to go get picked up. So we headed to a Krispy Kreme to go get this order picked up. Should be a pretty smooth. It's just boxes of donuts. I can't imagine it being like challenging in any way. So let's go get this thing picked up. We got uh, two delivered for later. One of them is like 11, the other one's like one. But um, that was pretty dope. I just got on the platform and I'm already getting multiple orders in a day. That's what's up, that's what's up. So no DoorDash this morning. Uh, my acceptance rate is so jacked up that I didn't bother waking up early to go try to get catering orders that I probably wasn't gonna be able to get anyway. So we're just starting our shift. It is eight o'clock. It's time to get some money, man. Let's get it. Catering order? Is it one of these two? Uh, what's the name? Uh, Dane Caskin. Uh, it don't tell me what it is. It's four hundred and ninety-three dollars worth of. I can't see it. I can just, I'm just here to pick it up. Deliver that is it, yeah. So all together you need 14 dozen plates and 12 of sort of. I'm good, how are you? Good. you? All the way through to the other side. We were, we were setting up on the back side building. All right. <laughs> I'm assuming you got donuts. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. <laughs> that was my next question. <laughs> Doing all right today? Yeah, how about you? I'm not complaining, man. Oh, really? Yeah. All right. Where did you put him on the table that we're opening? Got you, got you, got you. Thank you. You mind if I use one of these to like set them on? Need to get a 
signature from someone? Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. Y'all have a great one. Another one. I got two catering orders already, and I think one of them is around that time. We'll look at it when we get in the car. All right, family. So we got another delivered that. It's at 11:05. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna try to do both. I got one ending at 11:15. But if everything goes smoothly, I think I can be done with it before then. And I think I can do both of these orders. The pay was straight. It's close by my house. So I'm going to try it, man. If it gets to, uh, if I start to feel like I'm not going to be able to do it, then I will, I can always just unassign it delivered that won't be tripping but right now I got a shipped order so I'm gonna get this ship order shopped it's three items let's go do that get that money keep this thing moving oh yeah we out here man we on all the apps we trying to get all the money let's get it Sir, looking for a car seat. I don't got no picture, but try ride three and one.
worked out. I appreciate you, bro. Uh, yes, sir. I appreciate you, man. That's it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're right. That's it. You got it, man. Appreciate you, man. Alright fam, but uh, we got that shops, I'm about to pull up at the delivery right now, then we gotta get over here to pick up this delivered order, and we gotta be quick about it man, I might have bit off more than I could chew, but I'm gonna get to eating on it and find out, cause I ain't really trying to throw no order back, I want my order. out of here man get this money Got it done, we got it taken care of. And y'all won't believe this, man. I am 1.2 miles away from the catering pickup. Won't he do it? Oh man, I couldn't have, I could not have timed that any better. I just saw that I was going to Chapel Hill and I knew the catering order was in Chapel Hill. I knew I had 20 or so minutes to get there. I only need five. But I am gonna wait. Uh, well, let me see what is this around here. I might try to get a DoorDash, man. I am trying to kill it today, man. I got I got some money to get. I got some trips to plan. We finna turn this thing up a level. But yeah, that 1.2 miles from the drop off of my last order to my next order. That's good. It's real good. We'll get this thing picked up. Um, I haven't had to set up a delivery order. It's just been a hand, kind of like a handoff. So I'm counting on another one today. If I can hand this thing off right on time, I can get over here to get this other catering order picked up, which is not far from where I am either. But it's it's, it's going to be a little, a little tricky. We got we got to get to it. We don't got no time to waste. But let's get all we can get, man. DoorDash want to act funny. He ain't stopping nothing. Still gonna get that money. But yeah, I'm about to pull up. 
I'm gonna see what's around here. If it's something that I might think I might can get a good, decent order, not going too far, I'll cut DoorDash on for a couple minutes and see if we get one. If not, I'll probably just sit here and uh, wait on the exact time to go get this thing picked up so I can get to where I'm going quickly. But we rolling, man. We are rolling. And that's where it's going, right there. Like a mile away, so that's sweet. Let's get it though, man. Hopefully everything be ready. I don't wanna wait. I don't wanna have to wait on the order. That's the only thing I'm worried about. If it's ready, I can do my part. I can get it dropped off on time. But I had to wait on that um, that first catering order, that Krispy Kreme, which I don't mind on delivering that because you get paid for waiting. But let's get this thing picked up. Keep this shift moving. Let's get this money. All right, so we here, and I think I'm gonna go ahead and go in. It is 10.35, I was supposed to pick it up at 10.50. But if it's ready, it's ready, I mean. And if it's not, at least I can be in there waiting. So when it is ready, I can get on out here and get it dropped off. So let's go get this thing picked up. I see they still really opening up. They just now like taking the chairs off the table and whatnot, but time is money man let's go yeah I got a YouTube channel yeah Bull City Dasher you do too Bull City Dasher. Where? Yeah. Uh, like 840 right now. Yeah. Nah, I'm coming. It's coming though. Yeah. yeah. Doing pretty good lately, man. Yeah, I learned how to edit a little bit, a little better. Yeah. Nah, it ain't live. Nah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Let's get this thing dropped off. I had to park so far away. I'm not happy.
All right, family, let me give y'all the scoop, man. It's been crazy. It's been a crazy about an hour here. So, y'all knew I was late. I got there about 20 minutes late. I ain't gonna lie. But when I got to the restaurant, first the lady acted like she didn't know what an easy K to order was. She had no idea what I was talking about. She was just so confused. She needed to check with people in the back. La da da la. Long story short, I wait for 20 minutes. I hear she's on the phone and I can hear, welcome to Easy Cater. All right, so my antennas is up. I'm listening. Like, what you calling them for? I'm here to get the order. Where is it at? She tells them her husband left with the order five minutes after it was supposed to be picked up because last week a driver didn't show up for an order. So he already took my order. He didn't deliver it probably by the time I got there. Mind you, this lady let me sit in there for 20 more minutes. So I cut my DoorDash on and I left and uh, I called Deliver That because I mean, I, I was going to tell him I was late, but I also was trying to be compensated for my mileage and my time. I waited on hold. They said estimated wait time was 10, two minutes. I was on the phone for 20 minutes and then it, the call just disconnected. I called back. They said the same two minute thing. I waited like five minutes. And I just gave up at this point. Um, I already had a stack DoorDash order in the car. I just I just counted it as a loss. Uh, but I did just um, after I dropped off those DoorDash orders. Speed I, check reported ahead on I-885 North. I did get a, um, a text message from them saying they were sorry. They missed my call. If I needed anything, I could text them at this number or call back. So I just sent them a text message basically explaining everything that happened. You know, I was late. She didn't tell me the order was gone. She let me sit there for 20 more minutes. The whole thing I just told y'all. So I don't know what's going to come of it, but I'm a little, a little hot, man, because why you didn't just tell me that when I came? Like, why you didn't just say, oh, my husband took the order because we didn't know if you were coming. Why, I mean, why make me sit there and act like you don't know what's going on? It's your husband. You know all of this when Easy Cater is asking what time he left, what who the order was for, where it was going. You know all these answers on the phone with Easy Cater, but you talking to me like you don't know what's going on. Like so, that kind of rubbed me, man. I don't like stuff like that. Just tell me what it is. Like, oh, you were late. We lost money last week. We, my husband took the order. Just say that, so I can be on my way, man. I just sat here for 20 minutes during lunchtime for nothing. It's crazy, man. The app saying I'm an hour overdue by the time all of this is over and done with. I want that damn late. But we got another catering at 105. The pickup is 105. It's 1220. And I'm about six minutes from my house. So I'm going to run home, get me something to eat. And then we're gonna go get this catering order. And after I drop this one off, I'm good for a little while. I'm gonna um, probably do a dinner shift, about five, but I should be done with this, this second catering order about 1.30. And I'm gonna chill. I got a video I need to really finish. I've been working on it for a couple days not really doing much but I need to get that finished so I'm gonna go work on that try to get y'all a video this afternoon and then uh, time for me and I'm gonna get this one edited and get this one dropped out in the next couple days or so but that's where we at man so we did oh I forgot to tell y'all I got my tip on the uh, shipped order Thing had a twenty dollar tip on it, so that was a twenty seven dollar order for the car seat and the tampons. But yeah, that was all right. I'd be scared of them ship orders, man, because you 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 really playing Russian roulette. You just don't know what's gonna happen. You don't know if it's gonna be no tip, one dollar tip, or a big tip. I consider that a pretty big tip because it wasn't far. 
like I said, it took me right to my next catering order. It just, everything just been working out until that delivered that order that I just had all them issues with. But it is all good, man. I ain't mad. We, uh, we still up. When I get home, once I get me something to eat, I'm going to tally up all the receipts from the day and see where we at. But, hey, I'm good with it, man. We just got one more catering order to do. And it's some, some like, cupcakes. I went and picked up an order from them before, a catering order, and it was like a box like this big. I think it might have had a single cupcake in it. Hey, that ain't my business. But, yeah, let me get in here and get me something to eat. And then we're going to get this thing uh, wrapped up. But been pretty good day, man. We need to keep these keep these apps jumping like this. But it's Wednesday, man. I told y'all Wednesday is catering day. It's just, it's just the best day for catering. I don't know what it is. But Wednesday's always hit. But I'm going to wrap with y'all in a few minutes, man. Let me, uh, let me get to the house. Give me some grub. Let me get back to this money. I love it. I love it. All right, family. So I'm here. Get ready to go get this catering order picked up. I'm about five minutes early, which ain't early at all. That's right on time. So let's go get it, man. Uh, probably not gonna be a lot. I'm not. I'm not even too worried about that. But let's go get this thing picked up, and uh, this is gonna be the last order of the shift. We'll wrap, we'll chop it up before there. Let's go get this order picked up. Hi, I got an easy cater order. Uh, 158 QXC. See you day. Thank you. Enjoy. Now I won't get to. Thank you. I enjoy making the money now. <laughs> you have a good one. I've got a food delivery for you. Oh, yes. Um, we'll put someone right down. All right. Thank you. Okay. Bye. All right, family. That's it, it's a wrap. Cut the lights, cut the mics. We out of here. I appreciate y'all for riding with me, man, as always. Thank y'all for showing love to the channel, man. Y'all been showing out, man. We them subscribers is climbing. Videos, views is viewing. I couldn't do it without y'all, man. I really appreciate every, each and every one of y'all. We're going to keep making this content, man. I tell you, as long as y'all watch it, I'm going to make it.
pretty good day. Pretty good day, man. We didn't rely on DoorDash, but we still ate. Ain't that something? I throw all the numbers up because I'm going to be honest with you. I haven't even calculated in my own head. I don't know how much we made today, but I know we stayed busy. We didn't rely on DoorDash. We got that money. Even Ship showed us love today with the $20 tip. I mean, I really just got no complaints. I appreciate y'all for riding with me. Like I say in the end of every video, you can be anything in this world that you wanna be. Just don't be ungrateful. And whatever it is that you decide to be, be the best at it. It's your boy, Bull City Dasher, and I will most definitely catch y'all in the next one. Peace.